Hey guys, Danielle from Our Roaming Hearts, and today I'm going to be checking out the Ranch House Restaurant, located in Coulter Bay Village in the Grand Teton National Park, located on Jackson Lake. Let's go check it out. the skillet sausage biscuits gravy and eggs and it's almost too pretty to eat berry mule Bread is a sweet cornbread with cheese and like jalapeno peppers and fried pickles. Coffee barbecue brisket with the potato wedges and potato salad. Working my way through the fried pickles. Finished off the bread. While it had the jalapeno flavor in it, it was not spicy. This is a huckleberry white chocolate cheesecake. <laughs> it is almost too pretty to eat. Okay, so that food at the ranch house looked amazing, didn't it? So this morning I had the skillet sausage biscuits and gravy with an egg, their breakfast potatoes, and it was amazing. It came with that purple orchid, it was edible, I didn't try it. The gravy was a thyme sausage gravy and it was just amazing. Everything was homemade, it was fresh, it was hot, the service was really good. I was in and out of there in half the time I had allotted for breakfast, it was amazing. I came back for dinner, I had a little bit of a wait because it was dinner time and I came in about at about 7 p.m. prime dinner time and I started off with their drink of the day which was a huckleberry mule with huckleberry puree and some gin and lime and a few other things it was really good and then I had the dill pickle spears the fried pickle spears and those were really good as well fresh homemade breading the bread was a sweet cornbread with a 
with um, like cheddar cheese and jalapenos mixed in and it was not spicy at all. It was a sweet bread but it had the taste of the jalapenos and it had an amazing homemade butter to go with it. And then I had the coffee barbecue brisket with potato salad and potato wedges. All of it was homemade. All of it was hot and fresh. I wasn't a huge fan of the potato salad, but that was just me. It could have, I like my potato salad a little bit different than how they did it. It was like a mustard potato salad. Uh, the barbecue brisket was really good. It was, had the coffee rub on it. The barbecue sauce they put on was a little spicy, so it did have a little bit of a tang to it, but it was nothing overpowering. I don't like spicy food, and it was perfectly fine for me. I'm a complete wuss with spicy food. And it was really good. Potato wedges, again, were homemade. All really good. I then could not resist. They had a white chocolate huckleberry cheesecake. I am obsessed with huckleberries now since I've been here. And it was amazing. It was so beautiful. Too beautiful to eat. And it had that huckleberry purple um, like candy on top of it. And that was amazing. It was creamy. It was so rich. I was not able to finish it all by myself. I have not been this full in... A really really long time the food again it was all hot and fresh and homemade it was really good the service was fast and they were friendly and they were I was watching them they were right on top of cleaning up tables turning tables around they do have a all-you-can-eat bar for breakfast and dinner if that's what you want to do what you prefer so I am I joked and I said I could just live here. It, it, they have a grocery store, they have the cabins, they just have everything and the views, you just can't beat the views. So I definitely recommend the ranch house for any meal when you're in Coulter Bay, when you're in the national park, stop by. They have really good coffee, good food, friendly service. They have a bar there as well. It was all amazing. I hope this video helped with your Grand Teton National Park trip. Please give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below and the bell icon to get more notifications of our Grand Teton videos along with Yellowstone coming up and more travel videos. And let me know in the comments below if you've eaten at the ranch house. I'd love to know what you have and what your thoughts were. Check out the videos that are on the screen in front of you for some more great content and I'll see you in the next video.